Hey, what's going on guys, and welcome to potentially my biggest build here on the channel. I'm going to be showing you how to build the Statue of Liberty in Minecraft. This is a giant 30 by 30 by 150 blocks high. I'm going to show you exactly how to build it step by step. And of course, since this is such a big build, I'm going to have to break it up into multiple parts. This video you're watching right now is part one. And in part one, I'm going to show you how to build half of the base. So about halfway through the sandstone part. And in part two, I'll show you how to build the rest of the sandstone. And in parts three to five, maybe six, I'll show you how to build the Statue of Liberty. And before we start, here are the materials you'll be needing. You will need some sandstone, some cut sandstone, some sandstone stairs, some smooth sandstone, some sandstone slabs, and few sandstone walls. Alright, so the first step is to grab your sandstone and make a giant 30 by 30 square. Alright, so once you've done that, now add another three layers of sandstone on top of this. So make this whole square four blocks high. Alright, and once you've done that, now grab your cut sandstone and add a layer of cut sandstone on top of all of this. And so far, you should have four layers of sandstone and one layer of cut sandstone. Alright, so now grab your sandstone stairs and add another layer of it on top of all this. Alright, and once you've done that, now grab your cut sandstone and come on into the inside of the build and place cut sandstone behind all the stairs we just placed, just like this. Alright, and once you've done all that, grab your sandstone again, and come on here to where you place the cut sandstone, and place a regular sandstone diagonal to it. And now just bring this all around the build. Alright, so the next step is to grab your sandstone walls and place them at every corner, 
just like this. And I recommend placing a cut sandstone at the bottom just so you can see the gap right there. And now just do that to all the corners. Alright, now go back over to these sandstone walls you placed and place another three on top of them. So make sure this is four tall. And now do that to all four corners. Alright, so for the next step, grab your stairs and come over to one of the walls we placed, like right here. And place a stair, just like that. And place one like that. One over here. And another stair like this. So you should have this square shape. And now we're going to repeat this all around the build. And this is definitely going to get pretty annoying having to place two blocks like this. Another stair there, two blocks over there, placing another stair, breaking these. This is going to get really annoying. Especially since you have to repeat that about 50 times. So what you can do, place two blocks like this, two blocks like this, a slab right here, and a slab right here. This gives it the same shape, but it just doesn't look as good. Like notice how the slab is a bit darker than the blocks. I don't know, it just doesn't look as good as the stairs, but of course if you don't want to repeat the stairs process, the blocks and the slabs are much easier. But I definitely recommend the stairs, it's going to take a while, but definitely it'll look a lot better. Alright, and this is what you should have so far. Now the next step is pretty easy. Just grab your sandstone and add a layer of it on top of all the stairs we just placed. Alright, so now grab your sandstone, or cut sandstone, and add two layers of it on top of everything we just placed. Make sure you also put sandstone on top of um, the sandstone walls. 
and now just bring these two all the way around. Alright, once you've done that, grab your stairs and come over to the cut sandstone we just placed. And on the bottom layer, place an up da upside down stair. And on top of that, place a regular stair. And now just bring those two all the way around. If you're having trouble placing the stairs, here's a little trick that should help. If you click on the top half of a block, the stair will go upside down. But if you click on the bottom half of a stair, or of a block, the stair will go upright. So that should help while placing the bottom half of the stairs. But when you place the top half of the stairs, you can just click on the stair below you and it will just place upright also make sure you place some um, stairs in the corners just like that Before we move on to the next step, I found a little trick you can do with the corners. This just makes it look a lot better. So break these two blocks and break this block here too. And place a stair like this. So place it like this, facing you, this side. And do that over here and do that on the bottom too. And I just think this looks a lot nicer. So you can do this if you want to or just keep it how it was before. Alright, so this next step is pretty easy. Just grab your stairs again and come over to this cut sandstone we placed and place a stair like that and a stair like that. And now skip a block and place another two stairs. And now just repeat that all the way around. Alright, so now grab your cut sandstone and come over here behind the stairs we just placed. And place a cut sandstone right there, behind the stair. And now just bring that sandstone all the way around. Make sure it's behind the stairs though.
Alright, and now just add a, another layer of cut sandstone on top of the cut sandstone we just placed. Alright, and now grab your stairs and add a layer of it on top of the cut sandstone we just placed. Alright, and once you've done that, grab your cut sandstone again. And come over here behind the stairs we just placed. And place a cut sandstone diagonal to it. Just like this. And add another cut sandstone on top of that. And now bring these two blocks all the way around. Alright, and the next step is to grab your stairs and place a stair at every corner. It doesn't matter which way the stair is facing, just place a stair at every corner. Alright, and now place four stairs next to the stair you placed in the corner so you should have five stairs like this placing another four on the other side and so now you should have this little triangle stair shape in the corner five blocks on this side and five stairs on this side too and just do this to all the corners Alright, and now grab your sandstone, and you should have these gaps between the stairs. You're just going to want to fill these in with your sandstone. Just like this. And add another layer of sandstone on top of that. And do this to all the sides. Alright, and once you have this, grab your sandstone again, and place a sandstone at each end of this. And now fill that gap in with your cut sandstone. And add a layer of sandstone on top of all that. So you should have this so far. And now just do that to all the sides. Alright, and the next step is to grab your sandstone and place four right here behind it. 
and now just do that again to the other side right here and do that exact same thing again over here and over here and now place another four sandstone but on this side do that over here too once again over here and over here and you can just connect it right here so you should have this little triangle shape one over here three blocks here three blocks here and one block here and you can just fill in this gap with your sandstone make sure you place it one block down like this And now just do that to all the corners. Alright, and the next step is to grab your sandstone again and add four blocks right here. And now do that to the other end. And just do that to all the sides. Alright, and once you've done that, grab your smooth sandstone and place it one block behind, just like this, in the corner. Place two blocks above that. Bring this all the way over to here. Place two blocks underneath that. And bring this all the way back and connect it. And you can go ahead and fill this in too. So you should have this giant 3x10 rectangle and make sure this is one block behind the sandstone. And now you can grab your sandstone again and place it right here. You can just connect these two. So you should have this. And now just do this to all the sides. Alright, and now grab your sandstone and come over to the corners right here, these parts. And now just raise these all the way up until it lines up with the rest of the build, just like that. Do this to the whole corner. Alright, and now this is what it should look like. It should be even at the top. And now just do this to all four corners.
All right, and now grab your sandstone stairs and come over to a corner and skip down one block from the top and on this layer place stairs bring this all the way around and make sure you stop when you get there and right underneath that place upside down stairs just like this just like that and make sure you stop when you get here don't place stairs on that and now just do that to all the corners Alright, and once you've done that, grab your sandstone again and add a layer of sandstone right on top of this. On this layer. Add a layer of sandstone on top of that. Alright, and grab your stairs again, and on the sandstone we just placed, place some upside down stairs in front of it. And do this to the whole thing, all around. Even at the corners, like this. Alright, and now grab your sandstone again, and on top of these stairs we just placed, place a layer of sandstone on top of it. Alright, and that is it for part 1. Thank you so much for watching, and of course part 2 should be up by now. And I'll see you all at part 2.